the lawnmower Hey, it's uh, Dominic from Average Air Softers here, and I just wanted to give you guys a review on my Wii Tactical M4A1 uh, non riz of course. Um, this gun's actually really, really cool. It had, came with a lot of features on it that are very original in comparison. For example, um, it is a Navy SEAL 5 caliber with a 5.6 millimeter caliber uh, gun, but usually, so this is the airsoft version, of course, um, semi and full auto, it's kicking ass pretty good and then the awesome the most awesome part about this gun is that instead of having to switch the semi to reset your spring what you do is you just switch the selector switch um, to safe you hear that sound and that's the spring resetting so you don't have to shoot semi after going full auto for a little bit just to really reset the spring also the um, you have a full work dust cover or ejection port as some people call it with a hop up on the inside the bolt slides all the way forward it's really cool um, selector switch is crisp uh, came with 400 uh, high cap mag for the, just normal M4s. The greatest thing about this gun is probably the fact that it is LiPo ready. Uh, I have 11.1 volt LiPo battery. It's really good. I have a Vulcan uh, LiPo charger, LiPo slash life charger. It's really wow. nice. Um, I also have an NC Star optic, just a normal NC Star red dot here. I'll um, turn it on right here with just a normal switch. That's just a normal weaver rails, I guess. Um, it's nice LE stock metal buffer tube a lot of the pieces on this gun are metal the mag is slightly wobbly but that's because of the ma this mag if I take this mag out and switch to uh, a mag that I have in my vest it's just a normal mid cap uh, fits all Tokyo Marie M4s because this gun is Tokyo Marie compatible for internals and external just put it in and very little wobble anywhere the lipo is nice two point sling um, this gun all in all is very good shoots very fast and um, shoots harder and accurate. I love the fact that the hobby is adjustable for on-field adjustments. LE stock's metal, buffer tube metal. Oh, I'm sorry, LE stock is polymer. Uh, selector switch is crisp. All the things on this gun were well-made and it's a really good gun. Um, I also have uh, a vest that I bought at the same time with this gun. It's just a normal vest. I can't think of the company right now, but it does have, you know, everything you need, you know, tactical gun, of course. Whenever Daquan has to stay strapped in the hood, you got your little pea shooter. Take care of that. It's my bang gun. Um, but it does carry, I think, six shotgun shells, three pistols. Actually, no, five pistol mags. There's three here, and then three on the bottom. You just pop these, these pieces off, just like that, and there goes five pistol mags. A pistol holster that'll fit um, that. This right here, I can run pretty low. And sometimes it'll slip out, but that's because of the design of this model. So uh, I can just slide it in. And just run with it it's really nice um four high cap mid cap low cap mags of uh, m4 this is a really nice vest um also on the back i can put uh patches and all that all those different things you get off e-bike airsoft gi air splat but um this was the review of the e-tech lipo ready um, m4a1 non-riz edition and uh my combat vest all right uh you guys like comment subscribe and i'll see you next time see, peace